Thank you for that, Nick. And we have breaking news this morning out of Mount Vernon. Now police are investigating reports of a shooting. Brooke Slyer is live on scene. What can you tell us, Brooke? Well, Evie, I'm here at 17th Street and Logan Street, and this is where we were checking up on uh, reports of shots being fired early this morning, as well as a possible gunshot wound victim. Now, we have not had that confirmed with law enforcement at this time, but when we arrived here around 445 this morning, there were two marked Mount Vernon police vehicles, as well as two unmarked police vehicles. Now, behind me is what they were calling an active crime scene. You can see here the police tape. Now this was actually tied around this tree stretched all the way across the street and tied to that utility pole. Police also had some interest in some vehicles here behind me. Now at one point a vehicle with the Jefferson County Sheriff's Office did arrive here on scene stayed for about 20 or 30 minutes and then left. Now I'm going to have my cameraman here kind of show you a little bit more of the scene while I'm talking but uh, you know, normally when we arrive to a scene like this, we'll look for, you know, medics or ambulances or things like that. Now, we did not see any on scene when we arrived. We also haven't had a chance to talk to any witnesses yet this morning. No one's really come outside of their houses yet, but we did follow up with the Mount Vernon police chief as well as the Jefferson County uh, Sheriff's Office trying to get some of these details confirmed. So once we get those details confirmed, we'll go ahead and update for you. But from now, reporting in Mount Vernon, Brooks Liar, News 3, back to you.